Hello royal folks. It's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of royal news and analysis. But before we start, please subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon. Thanks. Now that Buckingham Palace confirmed that Meghan Markle will be sitting the coronation out in sunny California, while her husband, Prince Harry, represents the Sussexes, sources are saying that the Duchess made her decision based on the fact that her children, Archie and Lilibet, didn't play into any of the plans for the big day. Plus, it's Archie's fourth birthday, so there's a little more fun to be had than with something as stuffy as a coronation. The truth of the matter is the Duchess was never likely to attend the coronation, a source close to the royal family told the Mirror. The mood from California was that she felt increasingly put in an impossible position, and there's a fair sense of relief that the situation is resolved after so much speculation and uncertainty. The source continued, explaining that while Meghan attended the Queen's funeral last year, going to something like going to a coronation is very different than paying respects to her grandmother-in-law. It is one thing to attend the late Queen's funeral out of respect for Her Majesty, but another thing entirely to attend the start of a new reign, the source added. Additional sources claim that Meghan was always in a difficult spot when it comes to making an appearance at King Charles's big event. On one hand, there is a layer of royal duty to it all, even though she's not a senior royal anymore. On the other, she has been mistreated by the press in the UK and clearly doesn't feel supported by her in-laws, which was evidenced in her and Harry's Netflix special. She is very much damned if she does and damned if she doesn't, a second explained. As a mother, she's probably doing the right thing by her young children, which should be applauded. Royal expert Jenny Bond applauded the Sussex's decision, saying, Now that we know that he's coming, I'm very glad that he is coming to what is probably the most important day in his father's life. It would have been churlish not to do so. So what do you think about this news, guys? Please share your thoughts in the comments and let me know what you think. Until then, thanks for watching. We'll see you again with some more fascinating news about royal family. Thank you.